gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content. And let's just get right into it, man. Look, this is a guide for bums. Because I play with a lot of centers and a lot of them are bums. I mean, complete bums. And I'm telling you, y'all need this guy. I'm going to show you two games. I just made this guy. This guy's like an 85 or 86. I got one badge. One badge. A rebounding badge. And I got in wreck when I played with man. First game I played, I had five rebounds. Had to figure it out. Second game I played, I had 15. Third game, 21 rebounds. Badges don't mean a whole lot when you know what you're doing. You can beat, like, like for, so for everybody that's complaining about overall and all that, you can miss me with this, because the domination that you're about to see right here is crazy. Like I said, man, look, this is a guy for bums. If you're a center and your team always saying, dang, man, people making layups. Dang, man, why people doing this? Dang, we ain't getting no boards. And you're the center? Yeah, this guy's for you, my guy. Oh, we didn't I didn't choose. Now look, I don't got all my badges. That's a me problem. I'm not gonna sit here and be like, hey, well that guy right there, he, he played longer than me, blah, blah. No, I don't have chase down artists yet. I don't have rim protector yet. So I'm not gonna be able to, I'm not going to be able to get that block yet. But what I can do, from this point on, I'm gonna explain what I'm doing. I can use my IQ. And I can just win. Look at this right here. Stop the video. You see what? My guy got caught on the screen. What most of you centers, it looks like I'm doing what most of you centers do, right? Most of you centers stay, look, this is where you are. Right here. The whole game. My guy gets caught on the screen. I immediately recognize that he gets caught on the screen. Instead of me staying in the paint and guarding nobody, you know what I do? I take a few steps toward the guy. I don't have to get all the way there. He knows that just by me pulling up on him, he can't take this shot. So look, boom. Now, he took the shot, but still, and he got, the, I mean, it's 100% smothered, bro. Like, what am I supposed to do? If I got chase down artist, then what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna challenge that shot, and then I got chase down artist and real protector. That's getting blocked. I'm not worried about that. I ain't got a check, but that's a me problem. Another thing that y'all should do, watch during, to watch during this game, what I'm going to be doing as I inbound the ball. I see I got a trigger happy center that like to sit on the baseline and do all this stuff. Watch how we're going to treat him the rest of the game. Wait till he does that. Look, I recognize that this guy is not going to pass the ball because he doesn't have IQ. What do I do? I clear. I clear and hold the center up so he can't he can't even influence the play. Right here, I realize, okay, he ain't going to pass me the ball. Look, turn. Boom. You can't do nothing. You have to be able to do just little bitty stuff. Don't just run to the front of the rim and block your man's and block, block your man's uh, approach. And look, he takes this shot. What I did right here, you see this right here, centers? You see when he puts his arms behind him and turns his face toward the basket? This is called boxing out. Put some ass on somebody. This is what coach says do. Put some ass on him. Find somebody, put some ass on him. That's what y'all need to be doing instead of just pressing whack. There's two parts to rebounding. You press box out so that when he got here, he got boxed. Now, that it don't look like a huge box out, but look, boom. He catched the box out, and then I hit Y, and I got the board. Guess what happens? If I couldn't get the board, if I had to spray it the other way, my other guy, right? And then I get rewarded on the other end. We going to the 11th flow. These are the things, the little nuanced things that make centers better, but y'all don't do. Like I said, y'all sit there in the paint and would have let that dude shoot the three, and he would have got a three. They got a two, but still, it's not a three. It would have been a wide open three if I hadn't pulled up on that guy. But y'all never do that. A lot of y'all centers never do that. If it's outside of the paint, you just gonna stay there. And look, right here, we're gonna get to this. I have not set a screen for my guy the entire game. I look at him dribbling. I recognize that he's in trouble. I come and set a screen between him and the ball, uh, and, and, and the uh, guy playing defense, boom, so that he can get free. Now, he immediately looks for me. I come down. I look for him, set a screen again because he's in trouble again. Now look, now he got an open shot. I don't know why he took it. Right now I'm in a bad position. I wish I was in a better position. I tried to get in a better position, but that's why, I, I mean, that, that's the only thing you can do. Once I get moving truck, I'll be able to move and not move him out of there. But this is just, boy, what, I can't wait till I get my badges, bro. Because like I said, I can't be as effective as I want to be 
But guess whose fault that is for coming out here? That's my fault for coming out here. It ain't their fault for having their badges. It's my fault for coming out here without mine. Check it out. This is something else. All the congestion is in the paint. I know I can't score from here. He knows I can't score from here. But guess what? Guess what moves faster than any human in human existence? The ball. Boom. Throw it to him. Big layup. He got to respect me because I already scored on him once. So he know what time it is. All I wanted to do is look and see. I should have probably thrown an alley. Maybe throw it out of bounds. Boom. Quick pass. And in a hurry. Big buckets. This is what you got to do. Like I said, the little bit of stuff that you got to do as a center man. You, th these are the things that, that th this calls the game. Same thing here. Hedge. Hedge. Look right here. If I don't hedge right here, I can have stayed in the paint right here. But look, he's going to get a layup or a fading jump shot if I don't. So I'm going to hedge, hedge, hedge. Follow him to the rim. Now, he, he got a wide open shot uh, because the other guy didn't play defense. That ain't on me. The only thing I got to do is watch for when people set screens. Again, going to the rim. Like I said, man, there's so many little things. When y'all play center with me, I don't want to see you just running around and pressing triangle. I want to see you working. Center is like my boy Carlos Power. Center is dog work. That's what this is. Look at this right here. Dog work. He takes a shot. I box out. I'm not just spamming triangle. I am boxing out because I recognize there's another person down here with me. If I box him out, I can try to go get the ball, but they're going to get him the ball. Cool. I'm cool with that. He probably got 80 rebounding also. But guess what? I'm the first one down the court. Right. Don't just get complacent. Damn, man, you stole my rebound. No. This dog work down here. This ain't, this ain't glamorous. This is what center is. This dog work. You got to love this shit. You can't just be down here talking about running the play through me. Let's play inside out. Let's do this. Center is dog work. This ain't no, it ain't glamorous. It ain't jump shots. It's just like being in the trenches when you playing football. Nobody don't want to play lineman. That's dog work down there. That ain't no doggone, no doggone. You get the, the glory and the glamour, but guess what? You get the money if you're a good one. Look at this run straight down court. He don't know what to do. I can threaten everything here. Now, right there, I don't know what happened. I hit him with a great move, and then... Oh, the other, did the other guy block me? No, he got a desperation block. Wow. Okay, so he got a desperation block. Boom. He's really dead. I'm trying to lay it up on the other side of the rim. And, yeah, that, that didn't work. Okay, cool. My mistake. But I know what he likes to do now. I know that he's jump happy. So guess what we're going to do? And I'm going to show y'all one more game after this. And I'm going well, to absolutely massacre somebody. And then that's going to be it. But center is dog work, man. You got you to gotta get down there and love the dirty work. Love doing stuff that you don't want to do. These dudes are just button happy. Look, right? I knew. I knew. I recognized that he's why happy. So guess what we did? Baseline reverse, baby. Right? You can't stop that dunk. And they gave that to me as a center. It's about to get real ugly out here. This is my... Mm, I love this sh I love this shit. I love this center shit because y'all trash. Look at this. Box this bitch ass out. Look at this. Put some ass on him. Box him out. Y'all ain't never seen a center box out. I bet y'all guards watching this video like, God damn. I never seen so much L2 in my life with nobody. I know it's guards watching this video right now saying, damn. I wish my center would press L2 every now and again. I wish that he would, he would love the non-glamorous position, stop begging for the ball, trying to tell guards how to play. Look at this. Look at this. I ain't complaining. This dog work. He's sitting there with his hand up. What I did, slip in behind him. Put some ass on him. Put some ass on him. Big board. This is, the, I don't want it. It ain't glamorous. Kick it out. Trey ball. Smoke some. Yeah, 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 yeah. Smoke J's every day. I don't know what he did. It don't matter. I ain't complaining, man. You got to hit that shot. I ain't doing none of that. Look at these dudes. They're inspired by my performance. They're inspired by the dog work that I bring to this thing. Hey, Carlos, don't sue me, my guy. You know what I'm talking about. Look at this. Set another screen for him. Pull up. Smoke some. Big board because I'm in position. Don't worry. I do it myself. I know he jumped happy. I'm going to the other side of the rim. You got to love this, man. It got to be in your heart and your soul. You got to be a team player. You can't be one of them people that, that really want to be a guard. You really want to be a prima donna. You really want to be on the perimeter. You really want to be on the scene. You really want to get all the credit. No. You got to be like Paul will prevail. This is dog work. I will get my stuff here and there. Look. Oh, yeah. Now I got glass clean to take over. And I forgot that you get a thing on the ground when you take a shot, when somebody takes a shot. 
and I didn't know where it was. I'm like, what the hell is that on the ground? I don't know what this is. So, uh, yeah, but I made the adjustment next time. So we come down court. Look at this. Look at this. Set a screen. He blows it. I immediately go to where I know the ball is going. Yes, give me the ball. Rag! Two-piece. Uh -huh. Look at this. My first part game as a center, man. This is dog work right here. Ten points. Five boards. One, what, one, one ass is. That's how I go, man. That's what this is, bro. This is dog work down here. Why are we on intermission? This is dog work right here. You think Tate is my boy Tate too sick? Do you think he wants to be in the gym right now? Do you think he want to be lifting? This dog work. You want to be a gym star, though. If you want to be a gym star, this is what you got to do. You got to be in there lifting, doing your thing, getting busy. Like, ah, ah, look at that. His chest is on fire. 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 Anyway, back to it, man. Back to this dog work right here, man. Look, playing the next game. Next game, here we go. We out here. Look at look at look at what's going on. Check it out. Boom. Find it. Find it. Put some air. And we're gonna show this one more time. And then that's gonna be it. Look at this. Look at this on offense. I'm just gonna explain what's happening. I'm helping my guard out. Helping him out. Look at this. Look at this. Center don't want none. He don't want none. I'm, I'm hedging, so he can't. I'm limiting his options right off the bat. Playing everything. Find it. Put some ass on him. Give me this board. Throw that ball down court. That's another thing. When y'all centers get boards, stop, stop holding the ball. You got to whip that thing, man. Whip that thing down the court. Look at this. Look at this. Big board. I got position. You're not going to get boards just because you down there. You got to get position. If you had put some ass on him, he would have got it. I'm in the paint. Look at this. I shouldn't have been in the paint. I should have been out. Look at this, though. He go to the rim. Smoke some. Give me the ball. He tried to. He couldn't get it to me. One more time, big dog. Give me the ball. I'll put it in. I'll put it in. I say I'll. Woo. Move. Big move. Okay. Now, I didn't realize how much time we had on the clock. My bad. <laughs> but anyway, we back in it. This is this dog work. If y'all like this dog work series, let me know. 10%, my guy? Y'all like this dog work series, y'all? Y'all let me know. I'm going to go to the park and get it in. Look, I can tell that he wanted a screen. Give him the screen. Give him the slip. He ain't, he, he, you know what? Hey, this is one of my guys right here. Shout out to my guy, uh, Moneybag Dro. He, he hit me up after this. And he was like, yo, are you say he's from YouTube? Yes, I am, my guy. And you helped me win this game. So, hey, shout out to you and Twerk Faith. Look. Oh, yeah, I forgot to tell y'all. Inbounding the ball on the baseline. Run the baseline if you're a center, man. You can use the thing to run the baseline. And I had him running the baseline. I tried to come set him a screen. That didn't work right there. It is what it is. This game right here, look, I'm going to try to shadow him so he can't get him. He can get to the corner. He got the board. You can't. Okay. Okay. Look, he had good positioning because they had a fast break. So now it's my job to stop all of that. What do I got to do? I got to do the dog work. I'm down here. Pump fake. Spin. What you want to do? Right. He didn't know where he was at. I put his ass in the spin cycle. He didn't know what time it was. I realized at this point that my guys need my help. So this is what I'm going to do. Pull up on him. Stop him. They shouldn't have given me that steal. When I get intercepted, that will be a steal. But that's on me. I shouldn't have came out here without interceptor. Not, not, eh, he grinded for his badges and I didn't grind for mine. Look at that. Beat him back with the position. Heads and beating him back. Look at this. I'm a threat down here. You can't do that. Put some ass on him. Give me this board. Dog. This, that, now I understand what Carlos talking about. It ain't glamorous. Give me the ball. Kick it out. Because I won't. I, I should have dunked it, but you know it is what it is. Kick it out. Better chance. Another one. Look at the center kicking the ball out to the guards trying to get him some buckets. It ain't working. Two for a dollar. Two for a dollar. Three for a dollar. Sometimes two for a dollar don't work. So then you start. When two for a dollar goes twice and it doesn't work, that's when you start looking for your own shot as a center, provided that you can make it. Don't just automatically assume, oh, these guys trash. I'm going to go up every time, every time I get the ball. You ain't got no putback, King. I'm about to get it. Look at this. It's green, but I still had it boxed out. It's green, but I still had it boxed out. Let's go. Look at this. He want a screen. You want one? I got you, player. Look at him. He don't know what he's doing. Give it to me. Give it to me. I got you. Oh, here we go. Here we go. What you want? Right! Big dog work. I think I got a badge after that game. post spin technician. Didn't even try to use it. Now, so now I'm out here operating off of two badges. Dominate. Look at it. What you want to do? Look at this. 
bump him. Boy, when I get off ball pass, it's gonna be a problem. Look at this. I couldn't put no ass on him that time. But they gave the 2K guys blessed me with the board. Go to the rim. Why he ain't go to the rim? He probably was tired. It is what it is. Look at this. I'm in here though. Bucket! Cause I got my shot close at 83. I can hit those. I hit those. This is one of those few games where it could be glamorous. He shot a green. It ain't no, it ain't no need for going for the rebound. No need. Let's go. We back in it. Money bag dro. Looking for a screen. He get it to your boy. Look at me. Kick it to the corner. Looking for money bag dro. I'm right. Boy, that center down there soft is. He don't know. He one of them guys that, well, we got a center. We're going to win because most of the centers are trash. No, you ran into a dog today. That's what you ran into. And I understand I ain't playing no competition. And, they, and neither of y'all most of the time, but y'all still be giving up buckets and boards. I didn't get no good position that time. I was trying to pull up on the guy. Green. I didn't get I didn't get any position that time because I, I was trying to play defense. Sometimes you're going to get that up, but I'd rather get up a two than a three. But we back in it. Let's go. Look at this dude. He don't know what he do. I'm trying to get out of his way. Trying to get out of his way, but I want to be there when he shoots it for the rebound. If he would have passed it to me, it would have been an easy dunk. 14-12. We back in it. Let's go. Look at pulling up on him. Finding the center. He can't do nothing. Don't go up with that. Don't go up with that. That's 100% smothered, boy. That's right. This dog work. Give me the ball. Right. Cop back on him and throw that bitch straight to hell. Let's go. Look at that. I've inspired my team now. Look at this. Big steal. Give it back to me. Oh, yeah. What you want to do? Right. He can't guard me. When you start hooping, they will start trusting you, and then you get the glamour. Look at this. I have inspired my team. The inspiration badge is on platinum. It's on Hall of Fame. Green Bean Money Team. Let's go, Dro. This is what you do when you play the center and you do the dog work. Nobody don't want to always, nobody don't want no prima donna on their team. <sighs> Give it to me in the paint. <sighs> I will pirouette and I will go up with. No. You do the dog work and then you get the scraps. And I'm fine with the scraps. You got to be fine with the scraps. If you ain't fine, put some ass on them. It don't matter. If you ain't fine with the scraps, maybe you shouldn't have chose to be a dog. You chose your position. Go play guard, but play it for another team. But you know you on that team that got good guards, and you getting easy dubs. So do the dog work and get the scraps. That's what you do. Look, at he's out of bounds. What are you doing? Right, dunk on his ass backwards. I don't even want to look at him when I'm dunking on him. This is what you do. Look at this, pulling up on him, because I saw my guy. Get back up under him. He's scared now. He don't want none of this. Put some ass on him. He got that shot. 19-20. We in it, though. We in it. Six rebounds, 12 points. He don't want no screen. He want to go to the rim. He should have went, but he trusts his boy. Go up. Oh, oh. I, I trust you, though. Look, he don't even trust himself at this point because I done did all the dog work. Get over here. Get over. Look at the move I put on him. I trust you, my brother. Look, he said, I trust you to get this. No, I trust you. No, I don't want to be on your sellout video, Jay. Let's look at this. This is what it is. Look. Look, I got the lane. I got the lane. I could have went up, but I don't want to be on your sellout video on raising with randoms. So I'm gonna pass it to you. So if you fuck it up, then it's you. Now, nah, my brother, this good. I trust you. Wide open shot. I'm trying to pass the money back, Dro. But you wide open too. Nope, nope, nope. Don't want to be on that sellout video. All right, I, okay. Fine. I'll do it myself. I had to hit him with that Thanos real quick, and then say. Uh, look at this. Look at this. Get some moves about you in the post. Stop just holding the butt. Look at this. Uh, uh, uh. It is what it is, man. Look, 14.6 boards, 7 for 7. This is dog work. That's what this is. This ain't none of that pretty stuff. It ain't shooting threes. If you want to shoot threes, maybe you shouldn't be a center. If you want to go out there and, and dribble, maybe you shouldn't be a center. Because what's going to happen is when you run into a dog that really don't like nothing but this dirty shit, pause, it's going to be ugly. He's going to dog you, and then you're going to be wondering, well, it worked against everybody else. Well, that's fine if it worked against everybody else and you lose one game every now and again. That's cool. But this is a guide for sinners who are ass. This video should get 100,000 views. Why? Because there are an abundance of sinners out there that are ass. I've played with you. Take this guy. If you don't take nothing but one thing away from this, two or three things. Jump after you see people's feet leave the ground, number one. Number two, get your ass out of the paint and pull up on people sometimes 
because your guards need help. And when they're getting killed by a screen, the screener's guy has to step up. And number three, number one, it should have been number one. Put some ass on somebody. Put some ass on somebody and then get the board. That's how I'm getting boards without rebound chasing. One, one game we played yesterday, my teammate had 31 rebounds. I had 50 box outs, though. It don't matter. We won the game. I did the dog work so he could get the stats. I don't give a damn about no stats. I had 50 box outs. I counted them. It don't come up here, but guess what? I counted them. They in my heart. These, these box outs is in my heart. And guess what? Once I get all my badges, then I'll have those 50. Anyway, man, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Send this to your center. Tell him stop being a bitch, a baby black bitch. Be an alpha male and do the dog work. Stop being an omega. Because, see, if you're a beta, that just means you're second. Stop being an omega male. All the way in the back. The last one at the line. The last one to eat. Be an alpha male. You got to have an alpha male mentality. I'm gone, man. I don't even want to. I'm getting too hype. I'm going to the gym and dunk on a fucking, I mean, I mean somebody. I'm going to holler at y'all. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Holla! Hey, I'm sorry, man, but I get passionate when I talk about this center stuff, man. I haven't played an inside center since 2K16. So, 17, I played an outside center. 18, I played an outside center. 19, I didn't play center at all. I refused to. This is the first time I can play an inside center and actually play it. It's about to get ugly. Y'all want the bill? 300 likes, and I'm gone. Bless y'all, and go. Yeah, I'm out. Peace.